morning it's probably all kinds of terrible light in here right now but it is january 4th 2021 um, my first workout day of 2021 um, i decided to resume today because i've just been out of it um, during the holidays which is fine i really don't feel any type of way about it um i haven't gained a pound and that's because I didn't want to gain a pound. Um, I was not about to gain a pound. I enjoyed myself and I stayed on top of, you know, what I knew I needed to stay on top of. So today's my first workout day. And I'm going to do a team body projects workout because why not just throw myself back into it? Um, I do have one on my trimmer. I'll show y'all. So here's the SoFit trimmer two. Love it super supportive and i'm wearing it um if y'all follow me on instagram uh at moss fit if y'all don't go and follow your girl but um i'm wearing it outside my clothes today just because i wanted to see the difference um in how i sweat versus when it's skin to skin so i'm wearing it on the outside of my clothes pushing my products to their limits to see you know what they can what they can do, what they can't, what they can stand, what they can't. I am about to put my sneakers on because I'm still barefoot. Get my sneakers on, stretch, do a team body projects workout, and then I guess I'll, you know, transition into breakfast and then I'll be <clears throat> resuming my work from home. I look a mess. I know that, but. since my workout not that long um but i ate breakfast i had a very successful workout it feels so good to be back to like what i call my basics like my basics is back to working out back to well i didn't stop really eating healthy but um back to like extreme clean eating and like just back to the back to how i felt you know, in the beginning when I was just, I would wake up and work out and just feel so accomplished that I got up and did what I said I was going to do. Um, so workout complete right now. I'm about to straighten up because I threw a whole bunch of stuff around this morning. Excuse me. Looking for my weights, my little dumbbells and whole time they was in my trunk. But, um, I'm about to straighten up real quick and then do some work from home. Meal planning for this week. I'm not meal prepping, I don't think. Because like I just, me and food just don't go well to, like sometimes. So like I will probably waste a lot of food. But I do, um, I usually always know what I want a little bit to come up with like a plan for what I want to eat throughout the week. Whether I make it or not, I still come up with a meal plan because I'll just switch them around. If I say I'm going to have like a salad on Tuesday and I don't end up having that salad, then I'll just have it on Wednesday. Like I just like to have options out for me because of the kind of person that I am. And it feels good that it's only 11.46. It's only 11.46 right now. And two of my rings are closed. That's another thing. Um, a goal that I have for 2021 is to close all of my uh, rings on my Apple Watch. And I did that every day for months um almost every day there was like maybe a couple of days where like um like my I didn't meet my stand goal but I was always doing my calorie goal and my activity goal so I want to close all three of my rings every day like if I have a rest day fine but like every day I want to close my rings it's really important to me I don't know why but it's important to me that I close all those rings some more 2021 goals and plans and stuff that I want to put into motion but like I said I'm about to do some work from home straighten up a little bit and then I'll check back in with y'all to let y'all know what I'm doing yeah I'm so annoyed the whole time I thought I was recording my workout video and it cut off. My phone died, well my second device died. I think I got majority of it on, it was like 18 minutes, so 
18 out of like 30 something minutes but right now i am editing the video that you are watching right now and i just want to talk about how proud i am of myself for sticking to um you know what i said i was going to do when the year started um because not just yesterday but this morning like you know my mornings didn't really start off the best and usually when my mornings don't start off good i just you know i trash the whole day and i had to stop doing it because like i realized now that i can turn my day around um instead of just sulking and sitting in you know whatever feelings i'm having during the start of the day that's really something i wanted to do this year was um focus on I have a lot of focuses this year my business my YouTube channel my fitness me as a person um, I'm really trying to tap in with myself and figure out what makes me happy and what makes me tick and um, what I do like what I don't like what I can continue or what I won't um, in a lot of different areas of my life I feel like I'm at the self-discovery point um, well, I've been discovering myself since I started this journey and it hasn't been easy. Like I have, um, I've always thought of myself to be just one way. Um, and I had been living my life just that one way. And now that my life has changed and I live differently, it's, um, it's an adjustment. Adjusting is not easy. Balancing is not easy. Um, I'm still trying to balance working on myself. Uh, still working full-time, being a full-time single mom. It can be a lot if I allow it to be. So I'm trying to stop with like a lot of overthinking and just focus on the things that I can change in front of me. I said that I wanted to start cutting back on money too, um, just cutting back on my spending because I have a lot of goals, um, financial goals this year also. Another thing I really wanna get into this year is like my skincare, my hair care, even my nail care. That's something that I really wanted to get into, saving money and then doing a lot of my self-care routines at home. Um, coming up with a really good skincare routine or regimen, hair care regimen. Um, I wanted to start doing care for my teeth also, like teeth whitening and uh, oil pulling and stuff like that. So a lot of self-care regimens. I wanna get back to traveling. I know because of COVID, you know, nothing is like really open or like open, open, how I want it to be when I travel. Even if it's just weekend trips or day trips or, you know vacations vacations um travel safe but i'm definitely going to be doing some traveling this year i'm in the process now of uh, educating myself more on nutrition and exercise um because i really want to be able to give my all to my business and to the people who follow me and um you know follow me for inspiration or motivation like i want to be able to provide um more information for y'all so i want to educate myself so that I can do that for y'all and really start learning more about meditating and yoga and breathing exercises because they have really been a big part of like how I start my morning. I wanna do a lot more with my daughter this year. She is entering into year three. I cannot believe I have a three-year-old. Like it feels like just yesterday I was, I know everybody says it, but it really does feel like yesterday I just had her. I was just bringing her home and now she's three and she's telling me what she wants to eat and how she wants to play. But I really wanna start, you know, working on educating her early. Um, she got a couple of educational toys and books, um, things that she can learn from for Christmas. So I'm gonna start going over stuff like that with her. Um, more potty training. She does good for the most part, but she's still lazy, um, so. If she's playing with her tablet or she's playing with toys, she will not get up to go to the bathroom. But if we're like sitting together or we're talking and she feels like she has to go to the bathroom, she'll tell me. But if she's playing, it's a no-go. So I'm really trying to get her out of that, like to get her to go to the bathroom even when she's having fun and she doesn't want to stop having fun. I really want to spend more time with family and friends, traveling with family and friends. Um, some of those weekend trips, day trips or whatever can be, um, with family or friends of course but like whoever wants to join hit me up i do want to start reaching out more to my friends and family too it's not like i don't now but some more 2021 goals is for me to reach out to people and see how they are more often because you really never know what somebody is going through 
And if they just don't feel comfortable talking about it, I just want to make myself open and available to people to know that, you know, like I'm here to talk whenever. And even if they're good, just know that, you know, I'm thinking about them. But all those things and more this year, like I really just want to have the best, most positive year. I want to pour into myself. Um, and I'm not just sitting back saying, oh, you know, this is my year and I'm not working for it. Like I'm, this is my year and I'm busting my ass for it to be my year from beginning to end. As you sit back into your hips and bring your hands together at heart center so you can relax your shoulders. Not my